Hey guys, Young 40 Mom here. Um, I'm ready to go ahead and start uh, filming my stash video. I kind of got some things organized because I've got so much stuff. Um, I'm probably going to do it in parts because I don't want to make it too long and bore you guys. So I'm going to do it in sections. Um, the cross stitch section is probably, I've got two tubs full of stuff. Um, and then I've got a stack of patterns. I want to say maybe a foot and a half, two feet high. So I'm going to go ahead and um, get started on those, get that ready for you. Um, and my crochet will probably be really short um, because I've got several skeins of the same thing. Um, and then, uh, but I've got a few books I want to share, um, not only with cross stitch but also with the crochet. Um, I also have um, some scrapbooking stuff and rubber stamp stuff and I have some material stuff and just just an array of crafts, um, rubber band stuff, but anyway, um, I will be splitting this up, um, but this is going to be part one, and just sit back and I guess enjoy. Peace. Hey guys, Young 40 Mom. Hope everybody's having a great new year. It is January the 7th. Um, it's a Tuesday and the temperature is dropping very, very rapidly outside in Tennessee. Um, they're calling for delays in school tomorrow and actually some closings in Polk County. So, uh, it's getting a little nippy. Uh, we really haven't had a bad winter and I guess it's uh, now our time. Oh, look, I found a bead. Hmm, okay. Alright, um, so I want to go ahead and uh, get started on my pattern stash um, and just show you some things that are out there um, a lot of I, I don't think I've seen any of these that anybody has shown on YouTube because a lot of people are doing like the um, uh, dimensions gold kits and the um, heaven and earth designs and the um, mirabilias and I I would like to eventually do those I have some of those patterns um, for the heaven and earth designs because I thought I'd try one of the freebies and see but um, watching everybody and seeing the how they um, it's very time consuming and I like I don't I like instant gratification um, but I guess those are projects that um, I would probably have to do as a side hobby. So, um, as you, most of you already know, um, I have an Etsy shop, and so I'm trying to stitch up a lot of the patterns that I've been creating and showing, um, my progress on those, and been pretty pleased with that. I've got a couple more that I finally finished, and I've got some more landscapes in the work that I really want to do, and I think it's probably, stitching those is probably going to take up a lot of my time, so. Anyway, so, back to my, uh, stash. Um, I'm going to start with, I've got these uh, split up into categories as far as designer and um, maybe publisher. So uh, the first few I'm going to show you are from Dimensions. Um, and the prices that you see on some of these stickers are actually most of what I paid, but some of them I actually got at a better discount. So, uh, we'll start with this one. It's called Two Hearts. It's by Karen Avery. Um, it is Dimensions. This is two hearts that share one life, one love, will always know true joy. Um, and of course, it has 1998 on it, but of course, you can change it around and put a uh, different date. I just thought that was really pretty. I like the, uh, the detail in the bells and the... There's not much... Yeah, there's not that many colors in this one, so I'm pretty tickled. And it gives you a a really nice um, alphabet that you can change it up. But anyway, so okay, so there's that. Um, another one is Night Eyes. Is this not gorgeous? Oh, this would actually on a black. I think that would be a quick, quick, quick stitch. Oh, so you can't talk. Um, I took my tongue ring out for a few weeks, and now it's, uh, I'm trying to get used to having it back in my mouth. Sorry. <laughs> so, uh, so yeah. Just, uh, is that not, look how beautiful that is. I love that. Okay, so there's that. 
um, again, Dimensions by Paul Cults, K-U-L-L. Um, and then here is Oriental Butterfly. I love the Oriental prints. I think they're beautiful. Um, I probably would never hang one anywhere in my house except maybe in my craft room because it just does not match any of my decor. But I think they're beautiful and I love to stitch the... I, usually when I stitch something like this, I, I give it to someone. I give it away. But uh, that is by A Touch of Elegance. It's called Oriental Butterfly. Uh, it's Dimensions. That's really nice. All right, and then we have Charming Cottage. Again, Dimensions. This is by Barbara Mock. Charming Cottage, and that is just so pretty. Looks like it's got a lot of backstitching on it um, to show the detail on the the little cottage um, and the, the flowers, kind of to make them pop in the bridge. Uh, see that I haven't really looked at it in detail to find out if maybe there's a lot of um, uh, fresh knots. Yes, fresh knots. But uh, but yeah, that one's pretty. So that's my dimensions. That's the only thing I think I really have on the dimensions. Okay, so then we have little bits. Um, these are going to be Gloria and Pat designs. Um, I am going to be involved in a charity stitch. I will try to see if I can find the link and link it below. But if you're interested, uh, Gloria and Pat are doing um, a charity stitch that I found. I think it was on um, Charities um, group on Facebook, um, Cross Stitch, just for fun. Um, but somebody had posted on there and I thought it was really cool. But anyway, Gloria and Pat are giving away a free pattern. One's a boy, one's a girl. They are precious moments and I'm going to be involved in that. Um, you, you get the pattern, it's free, you stitch it and you send it in and then they uh, ship it off. I can't remember what country, but they put them together um, into quilts. Uh, for kids, so I thought oh, that was so great. I want to do something like that. So anyway, if if I f if I can remember, I'll put the link below. If you guys might be interested, if not, you can go to Charity, which is um, Charity's group on Facebook. It's called Cross Stitch, uh, just for fun, and um, uh, the lady has put the link on there. But anyway, okay. So back to my stash. Um, little bits by Alma Lynn. It has 12 designs on it, and it's just a little variation. It's really cool because you've got, you know, you've got a little spring, and you've got um, a little housewife, and then you've got the cat, and then you've got something for Halloween, and then you've got something for Christmas. And then on the back, um, another Christmas, uh, Grandma's Little Angel, and then we've got... America for a, an American holiday, and then we've got bees for the spring, and then um, and a, like a fairy, I guess. Stitching is heavenly. Oh, she's an angel. Um, and here's my heart. That could be cute for Valentine's. Okay, so there's that one. Then we have Calico Kittens. Um, I gifted this to someone recently. Um, and some of these patterns, um, I probably will still be gifting out because I know in my lifetime I will not be able to get to all of them uh, probably in two lifetimes I'd say because if you'll look this is my pattern stash yeah this <laughs> yeah there's no no absolute way I could do all those in my lifetime um but anyway um so yeah I had um I had two of these so I knew someone that um uh, like I said, if you subscribe to my channel and I and you do make videos, I do watch you and um, I, I, I if I have something in my stash that I think that you would enjoy, I will send it to you. But um, this is called Calico Kittens for all seasons. It's a Pat and Gloria design again, or Gloria and Pat. Uh, these are by Priscilla Hillman, and there's just really really cute. Oh, that's that's a pattern. Can't show you that. Um, celebrating 30 years, 1973 to 2003, and. Uh, but anyway, so yeah, those are really cute if you like cats. Um, let's see, we got Priscilla's Babyland by Priscilla Hillman again, exclusively for Hobby Lobby, made designed by Gloria and Pat. Um, we've got some snowmen, an angel, um, 
some more a bear angel and a little rabbit angel now see I've never seen that I'm, I'm I got these and I didn't really take the time to look at these um, I got them for the bears because I think this little I think their bears are really really cute then we got a little gingerbread man and there's another angel and another bear angel but, but yeah so cute all right there's that one then we have cherished teddies again uh, Priscilla Hillman Gloria and Pat design from birth to 10 years so it has a birthing announcement and then it has you know one year growing up there are 23 designs in this one let's see how many designs were in this other one uh, oh I didn't even get to show you all of them sorry I do apologize we had all those but there were some on the inside I didn't want to open it up oh oh wow yeah there's like 20 designs on this one too uh, and if any of you have watched my other videos, you know that um, Precious Moments saved my life. And, of course, Gloria and Pat are known for their Precious Moments books and patterns. Um, I quit smoking in 99, and I would have ended up with emphysema. It was really bad. I, I was the, I had the uh, bad cough and the wheezing, and, and I know it, it would have shortened my life big time. So uh, I had to keep my hands busy, and I did two of the Precious Moments books that had anywhere from like 15 to 20 patterns in each one, and I ended up uh, gifting all of those that I stitched up as gifts over the years. But anyway, okay, so this is the more of the patterns that was on the inside of the previous one I showed you. I apologize. I didn't realize. Oh, here's more. Look, look, look. Oh, you can tell I haven't really gone through my stash because I'm too busy stitching. And this one actually has a, oh, baby's first stocking. How adorable is that? Now, some of these would make, you know, these little quick, these would be quick whips for great Christmas cards. Um, let's see, 2003 was when this one came out. All right, back to the cherished teddies. I apologize. So that means on these, there's going to be, these are exclusive for Hobby Lobby. So I don't know if you can still get these or not. Um, okay, so birth to 10 years. There's that. Let's look at the back. Shows them. Oh, a little baby in a bassinet. See, this would make, oh, there's a little family. So that would make great, great cards. Oh, look at that. Or birthing announcements. So cute. All right. Um, here's some more. Oh, here we go. Yes, we got we got birthdays, and we've got. I guess that's what this is. These are different birthdays because there's one like with a seven. There's one with a two. I guess you could. Oh, and there's one with the four cutout. So that's got to be four. That one has three cupcakes for three. That one for one, six. That one has the candles on it for eight. Wouldn't that be great? You could stitch these up in a card and give a birthday card every year to the child up until age 10. That would be such a good idea. We got nine, ten, and then here's some little extra ones. Oh, this one is a mad teddy bear. Oh, I like that one. Oh, does that boo boo teddy bear? So cute. All right, so that's. Again, cherished teddies from birth to 10 years. I'm getting excited about my stash all over again, just showing this to you guys. That's so cool! All right. Um, again, cherished teddies. This one's called Gardening. Gardening Angels? My phone is ringing. Why is my phone ringing? I'll be right back. And we're back. Sorry about that. That was the soon-to-be ex checking on the child. Okay, so uh, where were we? Yes, cherished teddies. This is the Gardening Angels. Angels again, a glory and pat design. Um, I'm trying, like I said, I was doing this in, in groups so that um, you can see what I've got in my stash as far as um, uh, designers and publishers. Again, Priscilla Hillman. Um, these are the cherished teddies, and this just so cute. You've got like the the crowned queen bee there, um, and then we've got like the little angel, and then. Again, another angel. A lot of these are angels, so gardening angels. Well, there you go. Um, different aspects. Just so cute. Again, this is exclusively for Hobby Lobby. Um, those are the only, the only ones. There's six designs on this. And again, little quick whips. Um, little maybe uh, cards or pillow cushions or whatever. So there's that. 
Um, this one is called the, this one's really cute. I would love to do this one. This one's called the Bear Attitudes. Um, they are little bears. They are the Bee Attitudes. They're based on the Bee Attitudes from the book of Matthew in the Bible. There are 12 designs on this one. Again, a glory and pat. Um, and then it gives the, the little blessing and then it gives, or rather the beatitude, and then it gives the uh, scripture. That's not going to focus in. Okay, so I'm back again. <laughs> uh, my camera ran out of memory. Um, Matt and I uh, got a hold of my camera again and uh, it looks like she decided to do a video that we set up on the tripod but you can't see anything that she's put on there so she'll have to redo that but anyway okay so here's the second one and on the inside it shows again some more of the 12 beatitudes and that one's got a beehive how cute now it on the beatitude everything around it each one has a really cute little border with little bees. Every single one of them have a little border with little bees. So cute. And the different scriptures for Matthew and the Beatitudes. Um, let's see. There's that one. So cute. I love these multi-books. Um, usually what I do with the multi-books, and I'm sure a lot of you do the same thing, so that I can mark on the chart. I'll photocopy the chart and then mark it and then of course throw it away and toss it afterwards but um and in this book it's really cool because it, it shows you how to cross stitch on clothing with linen and it tells you exactly where to put the waist canvas and how you can stitch it and gives you oh, it's not focusing in sorry guys i gotta get a new camera i've had this one for seven years um but it gives you um it gives you step-by-step -step instructions on how you can put it on um, on a, a t-shirt or a sweatshirt or whatever. I think sweatshirts are the best actually because they, they like, tend to last a little bit longer. But it's pretty cool. And then uh, it also gives quilting instructions because you can take the 12 Beatitudes or Bear Attitudes and it shows you what it could look like as a quilt. Those of you quilters out there because you know we all have other hobbies usually besides cross stitch and some people do quilting I am not one of those people I will I did make a quilt one time for my mother Oops, there we go um, with a bunch of little tiny cross stitches and I did something similar to this but each one of the blocks was different sizes and it was really cool it was like a bunch of owls because she loved owls and little bird houses and it turned out really cute but Anyway, okay, so there's that one. It gives you all the instructions. Another Gloria and Pat, Precious Moments. Here we go. Sweet Land of Liberty. These are all patriotic little Precious Moment characters. So cool. And then here we've got Lady Liberty. Now, she's more like the Precious Moments, uh, Precious Girls, I think is what the grown-up version of the, the Precious Moment babies. They're called Precious Girls. Um, my daughter has uh, one of the Precious Girls, Precious Moments, Girls Club, I think is what it's called, uh, video. It's uh, Christian based. But anyway, little soldier, more little soldiers. So cool. And then we've got little Lady Liberty. That is so awesome. Little sailor boy. Uncle Sam has a child with a Bible. That is so cute. And then another another soldier I think yeah that's the only one the rest of the patterns are on the inside but that's sweet land of liberty was the name of that one then we have the precious moments the ABC's uh, wonderfully hopeless uh, aka charity um, like I said she's the one that has the uh, cross stitch group on Facebook she got a bunch of she likes precious moments she got a lot of precious moments book but this one is ABC's and it shows you on the back how you can do a quilt. It shows you for boys and girls. Or you could do an individual letter for pillows. You can do it on a shirt. And then on the inside, I like about this, it gives you ideas of how you can put uh, names together and, and frame them from the alphabet and the capital letters of course have little precious moments oh, I can't show you the it's pretty thick precious moments 
characters inside each of the each of the um, the capital letters. So cool. So there's 26 letters. Actually, mm, 6, 12, 52 letters because it's it shows the uh, blue for the boys. And I'm just going to run through this real quick because it'll take me forever if I do each one individually. And then it shows the pink for the girls. Hope I'm not making you seasick. Running through this. Look at that over ostrich. So cute. Okay, so. So there, and there's a bunny for a rabbit. So the, and an L for a lion. So it's not just the precious moments children. It's also, oh, I could hold it up this way. It's also um, different um, animals as well. And then of course we have, oh, there we go, whales, because I love, I love sea creatures. I love sea creatures. Um, Garfield and sea creatures. Anything having to do with the aquatic sea life. I love sea life. But anyway, so there's the girls in the pink. And then it looks like it's the same characters, just only in the pink instead. And instead of the boys, it's showing little girls for the... Oh, and for nurse. How cute. Maddie's grandmother would love that. She's a nurse. Um, and then it shows, yeah, little girl symbols for that. And then on the... See, again, it shows you... You could do something for your mom, or you could do, you know, all, all capitals, or you can do a capital and all lower letters. But, and then it gives you on the back, it gives you wall and in, uh, hanging instructions on how if you do a quilt, or again instructions on stitching with linen or on clothing. That's really awesome. So then we got this precious moments. This one is baby volume two. Again, precious moments by Gloria and Pat. Uh, so cute. I love these. I don't know if I can... Let's see if it's got more pictures on the inside. I think it does. There we go. Alright. I'm trying not to show you the... Their patterns are very simple. They're basic. If any of you have ever done these before, um, they're, they're very quick stitches, but the results are just, just so beautiful and so cute. Um... They use a lot of blocks of color, and then again they they pull it in with the with the back stitching, and they use various different colors. It's not just your basic black, or your basic 3371 black brown. They use all different colors in most of their books as far as uh, back stitching on them. But so cute, little angels. This one has wow. This one has quite a few, quite a few designs on it. But this is called Baby Book Two. And I think I have book one. And if I'm not mistaken, they put together a book that had books one and two combined. If I have that in my stash, which I'm about to find out, um, I will probably be gifting that as well. Um, or I might give it as my giveaway. We are very close to 250 subscribers, so I will probably be doing a giveaway within the next week or so. Um, let's see. And then on the back it shows um, where you could do a birthing announcement. All these little bit of, you could do a quilt um, or you could do the cross stitch as like a sampler and then put a birthing announcement at the bottom. It gives you an idea. That's one thing I like about these is they give you ideas of what you can do with their patterns, which is really cool. Um, okay, let's see. This is... I'm going to go, since I'm doing the baby one, I'll do this one next. This is the Precious Moments. Um, again, Gloria and Pat. This is uh, Precious Moments book 8 and 29. So they're calling this the baby book, but this is book... Um, at the top corner on each one, it shows you, it says PM, and then it gives a number, because they have so many books out there anymore for the Precious Moments, but this is this is the baby book. Um, this one has 33 designs, a bunch of little tiny ones. And then again, it shows you the same 
type quilt that you can put together as well. Now I have also cross stitched on plastic canvas and on um, on um, Fort Decon Ada so uh, and made cups um, insert cups um, that's going to be part of my stash I have quite a few of them Hobby Lobby carries them um, I don't know if Michaels carries them or not but um, I'm going to be showing you uh, in the near 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 future um, some of those but here's some more of the little designs so cute and then this one is as baby grows so it's got a measuring tape so cute I've got it showing it on a dowel um, this is a new design that they added to this book and then of course another birthing announcement uh, let's see okay these are on the inside don't want to show the pattern okay here we go see if I can get this in a good light. There we go. I love the salt light. It's broken, but it's working for the moment. Trying to avoid that glare. Oh, let's see. In the bathtub, playing with toys on a scale, feeding the bear, playing with a kitty, the bassinet, and the angels. Now, didn't we see that in one of the other books? I think we did. Hmm. PM 29. What did I say this was PM? Yep. See, here's exactly what I was talking about. Now, because I have this PM 29 in here, I will be gifting this. I'll either do it as my giveaway or I will be uh, gifting it out to a lucky subscriber. What I do when I do that is I will send you a, a, a private message um, on your... Um, YouTube channel and I will be now I, I like I said I don't know if I'll do it with this one or not I may end up doing this with my giveaway but there we go this is exactly what I was talking about I have extra stash and didn't know it all right so back to here um, let's see so you're gonna see more of the same from the other uh, mixed in with the from book eight so so cute on a microphone. See, that would be me, because I, I sing. I'm a, I'm a karaoke nut. Um, I ran the circuit uh, for four years before I had my child, and so cute. And, uh, yeah, so, yeah, I sang four nights a week for f almost five years. It's a little, a little over four years. Met my current soon-to-be ex-husband. <laughs> Add my daughter and there you go okay so here are some gifts for baby sets that you could put together um, there's a it looks like a, a hanging garment bag a burp cloth um, a bib set you could do that with the designs this one is like individual little wall hangings a quilt um, a pillow and then down here again um, the sets with the burping cloth and the bibs and the Towelette, and just some great gift ideas that you can do with these. Um, and then this one, this is so cute. So you could do that for the parents. And then there's a family. So adorable. We got one, two, three, four kids, mom and dad, and a bunch of pets and toys. So, yeah, so that's that one. All right, one more. Oh, looks like this one's starting to fade in the sun. I'm going to have to be careful with this. Okay, this is, looks like PM1 Revised, 15th Anniversary Edition. So this was the first one they ever did. Counting our memories together. Oh, sand, hour, hourglass sends time. Um, yeah, so, and of course, you know, they're famous for their little teary eyes. That is so cute. So I didn't realize I had the very first one. Now this will have, this one has um, all different characters. Let's revise. Oh, there's that glare. Okay, there we go. Different types of... Oh, look, little shepherd boy. And an Indian girl and an Indian boy. Let's see. Yes. Little teddy bear and the 
goose and oh little child with this report card little bunny little doggy there we go oh, too cute oh that's for if you're gonna be a doctor let's see all right here we go two little kids on a swing uh, brother helping sister get water out of a fountain gumball machine a little shepherd boy again and the patterns I'm, I'm not going to show you the pattern I'm going to glance at it real quick see it's they're huge so these you really don't you wouldn't even have to print it out you could probably look at it and it'd be okay all right so that's all I'm going to do for this stash um, again there's my pile I, I repiled it and this is why but this is just to give you guys an idea of, of what's out there because not everybody is able to get out to the stores or these are some things that you can't find anymore um, that you might be able to find on eBay um, or possibly Amazon they don't like a lot of these they, they probably don't even carry them in the stores anymore so you have to get them online so um, that is one thing that, that we are very resourceful us crafters and um, so hopefully this will give you some insight on some things that are out there and we will continue to the next part at another time because I don't want to make this too long it's long enough don't want to bore you um, hopefully this kept you interested and it's kind of hard to stitch and watch YouTube at the same time but we like to listen as well so that's it for me young 40 mom peace out and we will see you next time